Yeah, Mambo VP, welcome to my YouTube channel and today tutakuwa tuna discuss vitu vya msingi sana, okay? Kwa wengi wana trade uh, double top au M pattern kwa kukalili, lakini leo nitaenda kuwaonyesha ni namna gani unaweza ka trade not like retail traders kwa sababu retail traders wanachofundishwa ni kwamba kwanza kabisa waangalie zile inverted views au inverted v's sawa au first leg and second leg au angalie hivyo vitu ambacho wanaangalia always ni kukalili kwamba ukiwa na double top kama hii utasubiria ivunja hapa kwenye neckline baada ya kumevunja hapo kwenye neckline usubiri irudi ku retest alafu usal sasa hiyo sio kanuni hiyo sio kanuni na kwenye forex market utakiwi ku trade kwa kukalili okay so nitakuonyesha ni namna gani unaweza uka trade na uh, this pattern so, okay kitu cha kwanza hapo kwenye screen unaweza kaona tuna 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 double bottom mbili i mean aina tatu na unaweza kaona ile ya kwanza zile tops mbili this is not double bottom double top okay Unaweza kuona hizo double tops, hizo tops mbili zinalingana hapa. Unaweza kuona. Alafu hapa hii ya pili sasa unaweza kuona kwamba uh, top ya kwanza iko chini, alafu inayofuata iko juu zaidi ya top ya kwanza. Na hii ya tatu top ya kwanza iko juu na top inayofuata iko chini. Okay? So tofauti yao ni nini hapa? Sawa? iko hivi sawa hii ya kwanza you have to be very careful haina maana kwamba kila muda utakuwa unasubiri neckline neckline hii ivunjwe alafu price price ili trust back hapa alafu endelee kusell alafu sell at this point hakuna guarantee hiyo then work is stop loss up okay hakuna hakuna kitu ambacho kiko assured okay from just the point of view ya market structure uh, this concept is long okay this concept is long okay kwa sababu kama price imetoka hapa kwenye second top ikaje ikavunja neckline ikafika hapa kurudi juu almost aitakui ku retrace more than 61% okay lakini mara nyingi mimi mbona angalia 50% tumeelewana na hapa uweze ukasema this is 50% kwa concept ya kawaida okay lakini point ya msingi zaidi ya pili ni kwamba kwenye double top kama hii always kwenye double top kama hii huwa tunaamini hapa juu kuna liquidity za kutosha wai kwa sababu kuna eco highs okay considering the trend of the market unaweza kazi trade hizi double top vizuri sana kwa hicho ni kitu cha msingi pia lazima consider trend pia sasa mimi leo sitaongelea vitu vingi sana ila najaribu kukuonyesha ukweli kwamba kwa hiyo ukiwa na double top hii ya kwanza what you have to do angalia hiki kitu ambacho kinaonekana hapa sawa so, ngalia hiki kitu kinachoonekana hapa kuna uwezekano mkubwa sana price ikaja price inaweza ikaja ikapanda juu ku sweep out hii liquidity and then ikaangalia another kind of movement either kushuka chini sawa so, baada ya kuwa amechukua liquidity ili wapushi soko upande ambao wanataka that that is something ambacho kinaweza pia kutokea. Okay? Sawa. So, kwa hiyo you have to be very careful. Kwa sababu kwenye double top ambazo zinatengeneza eco tops kuna kuwa na eco highs and therefore kuna availability ya liquidity ya kutosha pale juu and therefore this case sio rahisi sana kwenda chini wakati wanaona juu kuna liquidity. Lakini remember sio kila double sio kila double tops kuna liquidity juu lazima kuwa na eco highs lakini pia consider uh, unatakuwa ku consider the trend of the market na 
momentum of the market tutazungumza on the on the tutazungumza siku nyingine okay lakini that is how that is how it has to be okay kitu kingine ni kwamba ukiwa na ukiwa na hii aina ya pili uh, sio swala la kusubiri unje hapa sawa alafu uingie sawa kwa sababu gani kwa sababu kwa sababu inaweza ikafanya kitu kama hiki hapa hapa ndo neckline hii ndo neckline right sawa hiyo ndo neckline unaweza kukuta sometimes ambacho kinatokea ni hiki hapa price price inakuja this way sawa wewe ukishaona hivi unaweka uh, pending order yako ambayo ni sell limit alafu price ikifika hapo ina mitigate sawa inaendi natafuta some sort of uh, something that will resist the price to go up ili rudi chini na ikishafika at this point wewe tayari you are out kwa sababu stop loss yako lazima utakuwa umeiweka above hiyo neckline okay alafu baadaye ndo unakuja unakuta market inashuka namna hii okay you are out of the market muda kama huo tayari wewe upo nje ya soko okay out of the stop loss yako imechukuliwa and therefore you have to wait for mitigation sawa so, you have to wait for mitigation and the violation of structures lazima usubirie shift of market especially kama market ipo kwenye uptrend you have to know that okay kitu kingine cha pili ni i mean the third point ni kwamba unapokuta ile top ya kwanza iko juu kuliko top inayofuata sawa so, you have to be very careful there sawa so, maana yake nini hapa kuna uwezekano price ikafanya hivi because most of retail traders wanaamini kwamba uh, ushaona remember remember tofauti ya top ya kwanza na ya pili remember tukisema double top hatuna maana lazima zile tops mbili ziwe at the same level almost 5% this is easy sana okay na mimi nimechola kwa ku consider hivyo that is assumption yenyewe okay so sijo kasema mbona hizi zingine mbili sio double top hapana they are still double top as long as as jazili 5% so lazima upate iko highs hicho ni kitu cha msingi pia unatakuwa ukijua so at this point kuna mtu atakuwa anasubiri ifike hapa na kamesha weka pending order zake hapa za sell limit alafu price inakuja inagusa inatoboa inaendi inagusa stop loss alafu kumbe ilikuwa tu ina create a lower highs na lower lows kwa hiyo unakuta inaendelea baada ya kwa kutoa sokoni unakuta inaanza kuendelea sasa kufanya zile zile kutengeneza structures zile zile wewe muda kama utayali you are out of the market okay sawa so, out of the market kwa hiyo don't just trade hiki ni kitu cha msingi zaidi naomba nimalizie sasa kwa kusema hiki usi trade double top kwa kukalili okay usi trade double top kwa kukalili make sure you understand the trend the theory behind double top okay sit na down sometimes unaweza kukuta hii double top inatengenezwa hapa alafu kujuu kuna imbalance and therefore price lazima ije grab alafu ikutane na imbalance iweze kurudi chini sit na down so you have to be very careful sio swala la kukalili okay na wale ambao bado waje join Telegram link nitaweka hapo chini kwa sababu watu wananiomba sana link ya Telegram. Okay, unaweza kunitafuta pia WhatsApp 0754985520 kama unahitaji link ya group hilo, okay? So that is how you have to to trade double double top. Kama una swali unaweza kauliza kwenye comment hapo nitakujibu lakini this is reality utakiwa ku trade double top kwa kukalili utakiwa ku trade chart patterns kwa kukalili that's why uh, kwenye FMR hatusomi chart patterns kama ambavyo watu wengine wanasoma na hatusomi kabisa chart patterns kwa hiyo kuna njia 
ambayo ni shortcut ya kufahamu kuepuka manipulations the the, the mabank na institution hedge funds na watu wengine so that is how so kama umependa video hii unaweza ku like usisahau ku subscribe ku comment lakini pia usisahau ku make sure una ni follow instagram flood of facts alafu twitter ni frankbonge_ thanks for listening